G'day everyone, and welcome back to Infinity Horde. After an extremely lucrative run through the Cracker Book at the end of yesterday, I've been sorting out my equipment overnight and finally spending the six skill points that I've accumulated, with points going into Agility, Deep Cuts, Hidden Strike, Shadows, and two into Daring Adventure, as I'm looking to get into the double rewards at some point. The goal for today is all about the mini bike. With only one magazine now needed before we can build it, I'm going to head out as soon as day breaks to do a lap of the outskirts of town, keeping an eye out for any passing gas stores that I can see. Small ones I'll hit up straight away, big ones I'll mark for investigation later and see if we can get lucky with Jen and try and get a quest to the same POI. So, it's just about time to head off. Overnight I've added the cement mixer, never too early to start to get some concrete mix ready. We also added our bellows to our forge, did a bunch of gear cleaning up and tidying up as well as moving a lot of mods around getting that blade mod the serrated blade mod that we got as a quest reward into our knife and shuffled a few other bits and pieces like the scope onto the crossbow so now it's time to head off let's do this lap see what we can find we're going to head over there to the quest eventually but we might head down this way first and see what we can find oh looks like we've got our first passing gas this one's not a small tier, I can't remember off the top of my head. So this is a tier 3. Since we're doing tier 3, we might not clear this one, but we'll mark it. If we haven't managed to get the required magazine and parts for the mini bike, we can always come back later. Here we go. Another little passing gas. We might just quickly clear this one. See what we can find. We'll strip pretty much everything we can. It's only a little tier one. So we'll grab what we can while we're here. Gonna salvage the minivan. Used up one of our engines to make the cement mixer. Pretty sure I only need one for the mini bike, but whoop, there we go, we got one anyway. So that's gonna be handy. I also think this is the one with a little window with a doggo inside. So let's just sneak around and have a look. No, no doggo this time, just a mo. That's all right. Before we wake him up, is inside over here. Need to switch ammo types since we also changed over from stone crossbow bolts to iron last night. Oh, hello. You got up in a hurry. And since I think there's only one more, let's just try and sneak in. I think that's it. Nope. Arlene's sneaking up on me. Unfortunately, no vehicles book. But we did get a nice little Iron Breaker mod. I've also been looting a whole bunch of letter boxes on the ride around town. Got a tool. Got the chance to get red gems. Rifle. We'll keep that one to sell Furious Fists and more repair crafting. Let's just do a quick loot. And wrench the petrol pump for the forge steel and iron. Okay, that was pretty useful. Get rid of some of the stuff that we don't need just to make room back in the infantry. Pair yeah, that to sell later. And then we're just gonna have to stash some stuff in the bike and we'll head on over to the quest. Well, we haven't quite made it to the quest yet. And there's another passing gas. This one looks like another tier one, so let's get into it. Bunch of money. It's most of the zombies. I think there might be. Yep, one more outside. The extra sneak is paying off, at least in a tier one. Let's head down. Clear out the zombies downstairs, finish the POI, and then we'll loot on the way back up. There's usually somebody in here. 
There we go. Any friends? Yep. Anybody in the toilet? No. All right, let's leave this baby. See what good stuff we can get. Ooh, we can make a hunting knife quality too, so we can actually get a better knife than we've got. We might need to look at that next time we're back at base. Okay, now let's head over and find that quest. Inventory is absolutely truckers, so we might need to build a little bit of a storage chest out the front, but that's no problem. Okay, quest's underway. Let's just quickly see what we can stash in the bike first. We've also got a few cooking mags, things to read, but otherwise we're still extremely uh, encumbered. So let's make a storage chest. Just to put some stuff in, make sure that we can clear this without running out of space. We don't need any of this during the actual POI itself. There we go. Now let's get underway. Since it's a fetch clear, we're gonna have to do the whole thing. So let's get in, let's do it, and we'll worry about all the looting at the end. Apart from these birds' nests, because apparently I can't resist. Down we hop. Problem. Who else have we got on the upper floor? Nobody home. Oh, waking up somebody. Waking up everybody. So much for that stealth point, hey? Makes it a little bit faster, I guess. Let's do the basement. Satchel's in the basement, so that's good. That's not a zombie. Like right, there's gonna be one around that corner and one around that corner, so let's go this way first. Hiding down, surely somewhere. There we go. Missed it. Don't forget that safe. We'll come back to that later. Can't see anything through there. Although I'm sure there's going to be somebody. Don't want to step on those. There are no zombies in here. I'm sure there are zombies in here. Where are you? Hello, Mr. Lumberjack. Ah, uh, yes, I remember this one. Let's drop down and have all the zombies spawn. With the really attractive loot pile there at the end. So, before we do that, give ourselves a way back out, shall we? Can't remember if this is an auto trigger. What do we do? Yep, it's an auto trigger. Let's get back out. You guys can come to me. Three. 
three more down this way. I'm guessing they're actually down the corridor. Let's just whack a ladder up, shall we? while you're there. Not quite an arrow to the knee, but you know. Oh, I lost a leg. Dog? Where's the dog? I think he's outside. It's clear as done. So the dog's not part of the POI. Which is interesting. Let's just grab this. No, the satchel's downstairs too. Where's the satchel? Here's the satchel. Okay, so. Here's the exit. Let's go back and do the looting though. Did not run out of lockbooks. But certainly, that dog sounds like it's getting closer. Oh, here they are. Well, that was the dog horde that found us. We're out of space. We've got a cookie mag, a trap mag, medical journal, some wiring, another forger head, another knife. We don't need that knife. We don't need that one. Got a handy land and a tech planet. Got a bit of space back. Let's carve up these dogs since they carved me up. We've got an infection. That was all sorts of bad. Sounds like there's still one more. So we want to go find where that dog is before it catches up to us. Beating their way in the front door. There he is. Oh, okay. Bit of an infection. And another dog still somewhere. And there he is. Wow. Is that five dogs? Six dogs. Are they breeding? Whoa. Okay. We've also got a sprain. Oh dear. All sorts of bad. Now that we've finished that day, let's finish the looting. Do this safe that I was about to do. There we go. Hey! Crappy bone knife. All right. I might just use up a bandage. I'll take care of that and at least give us a little bit of health back so that we can finish the loot. leveled up at least.
what do we got in here? We haven't done the kitchen. Okay, I think we're pretty much done. Let's see what we can grab back from our box. Take the most important things. Definitely need all of that. Run out of space already. I don't think there's anything that'll go in there. Is there anything in here that we want to trade off? We'll just have to come back for this one later, I think. Okay. Alright, let's head back, drop our gear off, and then go see Jen. Don't spend it all in one place. But if you do, make sure it's here. Okay, what have we got? Today we've got... Less damage, and do more damage indoors, that's not too bad. Or we can take a skill mag. I'm tempted to take the skill mag and hope we get lucky with the vehicles book, because we have been unsuccessful so far in finding anything. The other thing we need to do now, oh, we've got two infested clears. someone who's willing to get their hands. If you take a job, yeah. yeah. I Thornby residence. I've got just the job for some Johnny Town. We're Taylor Manor. I need someone and Hogzilla Ranch. So nothing nothing in a passing gas, which is a bit un unfortunate. I was hoping to get another shot at one of them to get a vehicle mag. But since we haven't, I'm gonna roll the dice and take an infested clear. You look like you could handle yourself. Wanna earn Oh, this is a dangerous one. Try not to um get radiated. Because I think we can hopefully knock that out by the end of today. And just before we do that though, I would love to make one of the cigars. If there's any testosterone, nope. And the other thing would be military fiber. Because we can make military stealth boots, but I'm not sure how if much we need. you find any extra medicine out there, I'll buy it off of you for a discount. Just the one? That's probably not a bad option actually. I think we've got everything else. So since you've got it, there's also the parts if we don't. I'm just gonna buy that, it's only 150. So if that'll get us level one military stealth boots, I reckon that's a pretty good option. I hope you get feeling better. Need a couple of plastic, duct tape, Two of those, all right. Craft away. That's only gonna be a few seconds. Let's grab that. And. Oh, three slot points. Let's just do that for now. Wear those. Let's pop these away. Have a look at that. Did we get no? We've got a forge books, knife books, which are still good, and fist books, which we don't need. Let's go and do this infested clear. Nothing like an infested quest late in the day when you're short of time. Let's see if we can wake everybody up. Come on. At your come, please. Single file. Just to make my life easier would be great. Good bag to start, I'll take that. Isn't it? Let's head 
poking through there. That's downstairs taken care of. Now just for the upstairs bedrooms, hopefully. Anyone out in the landing? Unlocked, unlocked. See through those doors. Anybody in the cupboard? Betty's outside. And a doggo. And a doggo. How did that miss? I think the stealth boots, the stealth boots and the stealth points are paying off for this one. Okay, just upstairs left with zombies. Is how do we get there? This is the locked room. Is there a ladder upstairs in here. Go up here this way then. Anybody behind us? Are they all gonna jump out and get me? There's a skater. Oh, there's quite a few in here. To go. Oh. oh, you almost stuck up on me. Sneaky, sneaky. Three to go. There's one at the back there. Looks like a leg poking out. Soldier. Please don't be a feral soldier. Cap done. All right. Well, that certainly went better than the uh, last infested clear that we needed to do. Pipe machine gun. Oh, look at all that 9mm ammo. That's fantastic. We're going to be needing that in the days to come. Shotgun Messiah book. I'll take that. Do a quick run around. Got one hour. Grab as much stuff as we can. Snake. Okay, just downstairs. 
got 30 minutes. Clear out a medical journal. Oh, an upbook. We've got a skill point. Jane's shutting up shop for the night. A suit. Books. No vehicle. Ah, oh, there's the vehicle book. I think that gets us the mini bike. Oh yeah. Well, it wasn't the way I was expecting to get it. <laughs> Through going through all the parts and gases, but we got there today just in the nick of time. Got 10 minutes left to grab a few more things. I'm sure we're missing some stuff. I'm just gonna eat that. Lead that too. I gotta remember the way to get out. I think it was this way. Forge mag, we'll take that forge steel for sure. Search these cars and then I think we'll be done. And an extra little vehicle mag just to make sure of it. Let's get out of here before anything bad comes and gets me in the night. So I hope you've enjoyed this episode, where I failed to find any vehicle books in any of the pus and gases that we looted, but I did manage to get that final magazine from the infested clear right at the end of the day. Please leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and consider subscribing if you'd like to keep up to date with the whole series. Thanks to my awesome Patreons for their support, thanks to you for watching this video, and as always, happy building.